Wh why are the interns locked in there? Okay, there's an explanation. So you know the collector from Infinity Gauntlet and from Marvel's but, Guardians of the Galaxy? You can't collect just... the interns, Lorraine. But please, I'm just gonna have them fight each other. Absolutely not. I never get to do anything fun. This is not fun. I mean, fun is really in the eye of the beholder. Hey Marvelites, I'm Lorraine Sink and you are watching The Watcher. Today we explore the brand spanking new Marvel Contest of Champions, the free to play fighting game for mobile devices. Apparently you shouldn't enact this game with interns because it's dangerous and illegal and putting us all at risk. <laughs> Whatever. Luckily we still have Marvel Contest of Champions for battle packed fun. The Collector has summoned you to a contest of epic proportions against villainous Kang the Conqueror. As you quest to conquer Kang, you battle to unlock new heroes and villains with which to assemble your team. After all, it's up to you to prevent the total destruction of the Marvel Universe. Here is what we're loving about Marvel Contest of Champions. Sam the Hammer Humphreys of Legendary Star-Lord writes the storyline for the game for major Marvel authenticity. For those of you unfamiliar with this work, it's edgy, it's funny, and it delves deep into the Marvel experience because, true fact, his hair is full of Marvel secrets. The Collector, you loved him in Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy, and now you get to team up with that white-haired hobbyist to collect your own awesome team of heroes and villains as you level up. The game kicks off with 25 playable characters, with more being added as the game progresses. Yep. Marvel fans can use their comic knowledge for good. I know you Marvelites are gonna geek out over this one as you manage your team based on group affiliations and relationships straight from the comic book pages, you earn synergy bonuses. And of course, the strongest heroes and villains of the comics universe possess the strongest in-game stats. And you thought that knowledge was all just good for trivia night. Quests go on an epic journey through dynamic quest maps exploring iconic locations of the Marvel Universe. And while you're there, battle! Play against the game or against your friends and family in player versus player mode. Take that, mom. And last up, it's totally free. Download Marvel Contest of Champions now on Google Play or on the App Store. What are you guys most excited to see in Marvel Contest of Champions? Tell me down below. And now it's time for the Marvel Minute where I give you 60 seconds of the biggest news in the Marvel Universe. Daisy, Daisy, sky is Daisy Johnson. In the stirring winter finale of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., it was revealed that sky is in fact Daisy Johnson which had us all quaking in our seats. This means her father is none other than Mr. Hyde. But what about poor Trip and what's with Raina's skin? Oh, the inhumanity. Get all of the confidential details now with exclusive interviews and in-depth analysis on marvel.com and on our This Week in Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. podcast. Big comics hit stacks this week. Celebrate Hobgoblin Day in Axis Hobgoblin, number three by Kevin Shinnick and Javier Rodriguez. All Hail the Dark Queen in Inhuman, number 10 by Charles Soule and Ryan Stegman. Find out which Spider Woman is actually Spider Woman in Spider Woman, number two by Dennis Hopeless with art by Greg Land. And buckle in for in-flight turbulence that only Aurora could weather in Storm, number six by Greg Pop and Al Barrio Nuevo. What comics are you guys most excited for this week? Tell me down below and I will see you next time, true believers. I'm Lorraine Sink from Marvel, your universe. Thanks for watching The Watcher. Like, subscribe, and don't forget to check out these other marvelous videos. Has anybody seen those interns? What? No interns were hummed in the making of this video.